Okay, students, it's uh, 1 p.m. and we are going to start the lesson now. So I hope all of you are ready. All right. Um, are all of you ready for the lesson? Okay, if you are ready, can you please raise your hand, everybody? Try the function. It's at the bottom right hand corner of your of your screen, bottom right hand corner. Can all of you raise your hand now? Waiting for everybody to raise their hand. Even nice. Okay, all of you raise your hand. That's awesome. Okay. We are ready to start. Okay, so later on, if you want to speak, please use the raise hand function. Okay, because I've already um I can't get everybody speaking at the same time. So therefore I will need each of you to speak one by one. Okay, today we're gonna learn about giving directions using verbs and prepositions. Okay, as you can see just now, I've already gone through with some of your friends here. What is the meaning of verb and preposition? Okay, but essentially, um, you will be using verbs and prepositions to give directions, and you will be listening and speaking. Okay, I need Isabella. Hi, Isabella. Could you look at the screen? Hi. And William, could you please enter your webcam? Hi. Hi, okay. Right. Let's move on. To the basics okay just now we have already spoken about verbs okay other than william isabella ryan and stephen i want uh the four of you cannot answer this question i want to win Eason and crystal okay any one of you could tell me what is the meaning of a verb raise your hand hi to win Eason, crystal yes okay Eason. yes could you tell us what is a um, verb a word that describes movement Movement. Okay, so most of you use movement. I would say that an action is more accurate. An action. Okay, but well done. Okay, movement is also very close. Well done. Next one. Okay, prepositions. Okay, just now we have already spoken about preposition. I will not I will not ask you. I will just let you know that prepositions are words to describe places, uh the place and time. So basically, we need to tell when something is next to something, something is under something. So we use prepositions. Okay, let's start with the first activity here. Okay, we in today's lesson, we'll be learning using all these words to give directions. Later on, you'll be given a list of words when to help you give directions. So don't worry about that. We will come, come back to this later on. Okay, let's look at the first activity. We will, I'm going to use... I'm going to see who will answer the first question. Crystal, you're the lucky one. Hi, Crystal. Hello. Hi. Okay, I am going to... Could you please um, circle hospital for me from this uh, picture? Excellent. Okay. That is very well done, okay? Now, for my next one, where is the park? Stephen. Hi, Stephen. Could you please identify the park for us? We are at number two. Uh, where can Which you... one is the park? Okay, I'm going to authorize you. And Could you please circle the park for us? Well done. Okay, this is not a problem. Next one. next person is going to tell us where's the bus stop crystal again okay i'm gonna go to the next person because it's the same one ryan ryan hi ryan Could you please tell us where the bus stop? okay that's perfect well done all right next one The train station, uh, Stephen. Nice. Okay, next one, we have William. Hi, William. Hi. Could you tell us where's the supermarket? Okay. Well done. Okay, next person. Uh, let me give you a trophy. 
the police station, Ethan. Where is the police station? Uh, I can't circle. All right. Uh, oh, Isabella is has helped you because I uh right. Okay, so the last one. Uh, let's do the last one. Maybe I'll just get uh, Isabella, your turn now. Okay, the next one. Are you able to circle? Where's the post office? No. Nope. Okay. Oh, now. Now you can. Okay, great. Okay, let's move on to the next activity. Now, we are going to use some prepositions, uh, go through some prepositions, and you are going to try to select the correct answer for me. Okay, so question one. Which building is next to the sports center? Okay, I'm going to give you the choice very quickly. Okay, you do not have to raise your hand. Everybody get to answer this. Okay, everybody get to answer this. All right, could you please choose the answer? Okay, I only have two answers so far. Four answers, four more, three more actually. I'm waiting for everybody to submit their answer before I uh, show you. All right, let me show you where the sports center is. The sports center is here. Okay, can you see my laser pointer? Which building is next to the sports center? I'm still waiting for some of you. And William, why are you offline, William? Hi, William, are you okay? William is offline. Okay. Hi, William. Are you okay? Uh, yeah. All right. I'm still waiting for, I think, one more person to answer. Sports Center. Which building is next to the Sports Center? All right. I'm going to give five more seconds. If nobody answers, I'm going to end this answer right now. All right. All of you. One person chose B, one person chose B, okay, but as you can probably tell by now, the theater is next to the sports center, okay, let's move on. Next question, okay, which building is opposite past house? Which building is opposite past house? You can begin answering right now. The past house is here. the house is here. All right. Meanwhile, please get familiar with this map because we are gonna we are going to give directions according to this map later on. Hmm. Interesting answers I have here. Pasta house. Opposite. Which building is opposite? Okay. Remember what is the meaning of opposite? Okay. Opposite means across. Okay. Across the road. Opposite. A pasta house is a, a place where someone goes to have a meal with pasta. Okay, pasta is a, is a Western cuisine, Italian cuisine. All right, uh, someone is changing answer. Okay, let's take a look. Most of you chose B. Most of you chose B. Okay, can I get uh, maybe, let's get Ryan. Hi, Ryan. Hello. Could you explain to me why you chose B? Why? Because the opposite is the opposite of our pasta house means behind it or in front of it. But since the opposite, there's only the church, which is the opposite. Why is it not the Grand Hotel? The Grand Hotel is actually not the opposite because it's not. I don't know how to explain this. Right. The Grand Hotel is it's, behind. The pasta house, right? 
Yeah. Yeah. So you're gonna look look at where the pasta house is facing. Okay. So well done. Well done here. Thank you for the explanation. Right. Okay. Let's go on to the next question. We have a question three here. Which building is in between the cafe and the Chinese restaurant? Okay. Which which building is in between the cafe and the Chinese restaurant? Okay. Let me point point to you. Where is the Chinese restaurant? It's here. Okay. I'm not going to show you the cafe, so you're going to choose, uh, try to spot the cafe on your own, own. This is probably going to be pretty simple. Nice. Okay. I have two more students. Uh, one more. Okay, Chinese restaurant is here. The cafe is here. What is the meaning of in between? Okay, I have one more student waiting to answer. All right. All of you have answered. Nice. Okay. So I'm going to get Isabella. Hi, Isabella. What do you choose? Uh, D. D. And which building is D? Supermarket. Supermarket. Okay. So, what is the meaning of in between? Like in between, like is that like if there's two people and then it's this people is in between, like in the middle of the. In the middle of very 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 nice. Okay. So actually, in the middle of is another is another way of saying in between. Well done. Okay. I'm gonna skip the next question. Uh. I will be going on to the next activity. Okay, so all of you must listen closely right now. Okay, must listen closely. I'm going to give you instructions. Okay, and all of you, I will be giving you a little whiteboard for you to write your answer. Okay, for you to write your answer. And after you listen to me, you are going to write down your answer on the whiteboard. Okay, on the whiteboard. So you have to listen to my instructions very carefully. Okay, I will try to speak. Let me load up the whiteboard for now. All right. Okay, the first, the first place that you need to identify for me, just follow the instructions. Can all of you see where our current location is? Our current location is here, okay, at the bottom right hand corner of the map. Okay, can I get all of you to acknowledge me if you can see our current location, starting location? Can you please raise your hand, all of you? If you can see our starting location, raise your hand. Starting location, raise your hand. Nice, okay, thank you very much. Okay, we are going to start. The first direction I'm giving you is walk along Hillside Road until you see the park. Walk along Hillside Road until you see the park. Make a right turn. Make a right turn into North Road. Make a, make a right turn into North Road. Walk straight ahead. Walk straight ahead. Take the first right into Station Road. Walk past the pasta house. Your destination is the building on the left. All right, could you please write your answer right now? What is the building that I'm directing you to? Okay, I'm going to repeat my instructions from the beginning, eh? from the beginning. Walk along Hillside Road from the starting point until you see the park. Make a right turn into North Road. Walk straight ahead. Take the first right into Station Road. Walk past, walk past, past the house. Your destination is the building on the left. Okay, could you please write down the building for me? Okay, I see some of you have already written down the answer. Let's just wait for the rest. Oops. All right, some of you say, I don't understand. But some of you have already given me the correct answer. Okay, some of you are typing your answer as well. Well done. 
All right. Let me. Okay, I think I can stop the activity for now. Uh, Crystal is okay. Uh, I'm gonna explain to you. Maybe let me get. Let me get someone to explain. Let me get. Stephen. Hi, Stephen. Okay, I'm going to collect back your drawing for now. Stephen, your answer given here was news agent. Right? Yeah. Okay, so um, first, let me give you a trophy for answering this correctly. I'm going to explain to all of you how it works. Our starting point is Hillside Road, right? Okay, maybe let me get Isabella out because, like, or Crystal, Crystal. Hi, Crystal. You said you don't know, right? Mm. All right, let me explain to you. So, our starting point is here, right? First instruction was walk along the road. What is the meaning of along? Along the road means go straight. Can you see me? The laser pointer? Yes. Sir. All right, then I say take. Take the first, take the right turn. When you see the front, make the right turn into the north road. Okay, and then take the first right into Station Road. Walk past the pasta house here, and your building is on the left. Therefore, what is the answer? What is the answer, Crystal? Mm, new. I don't know how to read this word. All right, it is pronounced as news agent. Oh. News agent. Could you could you read that for me? News agent. News agent. Well done. All right, I'm gonna put you back for now. All right. Let's get some of you to talk to me, okay? And uh, give me directions, okay? Let's see who is the lucky one right now. Let's see the lucky one. Hi, Ryan. It's you again. Oh, it's aren't, me. Aren't you happy? So yeah, so I tell you where to go using prepositions and verbs. No, I will, I will ask you to lead me to a place. Okay, so could you, could you point me towards the bus stop, please? Okay, so you are here, still at Hillside Road right here. All right, so let me give you, give you the access to, could you use the laser pointer to point to us? Uh, I can't, oh. You can. So we start here. You are here. Are you using the laser pointer? No, I actually have the marker. Marker. Okay, that is fine. You can actually do that. Okay, we start here. Could you point us to the direction to the to the bus stop, please? Okay, so I start here, right? Yeah, you start here. The hills. Uh, here. You are here. Okay. So go straight all the way to North Road, you turn right. Until you see the park, you go right again and until keep on going park. forward until you see the church. The church which is at your right, you go left again to the pastor house which is there. Hmm. Could you could you start from the beginning because I'm a, a a little bit lost right now? I'm not familiar with hmm. that. So go straight. Right. On Hillside Road, turn right. Okay, when you go straight to Hillside Road, you all, you could see Hillside School, right? Now you go to North Road, Hillside School, North Road, and then turn right. Turn right. Okay, nice. Okay, I'm on the road right now. All right, keep on going to Northside Road until you see the church. You see church right here, right? Right now. All right, now go on Station Road. Station Road. Oh, Station Road is here. Yes. All the way until you see the train station here, the church here, and the parking lot here. Nice. When you see all of those, you go to the church at Station Road. I go to the church. So right now I need to go to the church. No, 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 I'm not go to the church. You stay at Station Road. Can you see the church? I can see the church right now, yes. Okay, and then turn left. When you see the church, you're on the right, right? Then 
all the way to left, you see the pastor house and the news agent. So what you meant to say was when you see the church on your right. Yes. Uh, and then you try to turn left into the bus station. Well done. Okay, that is actually very well done. Okay, except for some improvements. Okay, next one. Next one, who would like to answer the next question? Who can point me to... Okay, use the raise hand function. All right, I see Isabella raising your hand. Hi, Isabella. Hi. Hello. Hi, could you point us to the park, please? Could you point us to the park, please? Hi, Isabella. And the, and the left, left up. Like, like you first go right in the hillside road, and then until north. Okay, could you start from beginning? I'm sorry. We are here. We are actually here. You are here. Yep. And then go to hillside road all the way to here north, and then the north, and then go to the Charlie Street. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. Okay. Can we start from the beginning, please? Okay. You are here. Hellside Road. And then more. Could you use you Could you use some verbs to help us? Could you say walk straight ahead? Walk, walk straight ahead until you have the north and then go right. That's correct. To the road. You will see the king head pug. Yes. And then on the road. Go to the Albert, oh no, go to the park lane. Uh, which direction am I turning into the park lane? Oh, and the left. It's left, left turn. And, and then go up a little, and then there's the park. Well done. Thank you very much. Okay, please remember to use more verbs such as walk straight ahead, turn left, and, and words like that. Is that okay, Isabella? Okay. Well done. Okay, I'm going to put you back right now, okay? And, uh, let me try to, I need people to stop drawing. Okay, next one, maybe I'll just give you the place first and then I'll ask you to raise your hand afterwards, okay? Uh, could you point me the direction towards the Cranberry Town? Who would like to answer this? The Cranberry Town. William, hi William. William. Do we have to start in the you are here? We yes, we have to start at you are here. Uh point us okay. to the towards uh cranberry town. Where's okay. cranberry town? Move, cranberry town is here. Move okay. forward. Um you have to move forward till you are at Charles Street and then turn left. Is that so straightforward? Then, hmm. All right, what is the no first thing? go you go forward to um, North Street, and then you still, and then you go forward again um, to Charles Street, and then turn left, and then you could go to um, Canary Town. All right, could I could I give you some advice? I think first you should say, "Let's walk straight ahead along Hillside Road until okay. you reach the North Road." Until you want yeah, the north then, road, and then you, um, and then you have to walk along Charles Street. Right, you, have you to cross the uh, road first and, and go then, straight towards. Yeah, go straight and then, um, toward, um, you go straight, east, um, on the Charles Street, and then once you saw the, the pathway to the road to, um, the road that is, um, pointing to the left um turn left and and then you could go to Cambry town all right well done thank right. you very much put you back for now. all right the next one uh might be the last one that we are actually looking at here could someone point me towards the direction of the tr mm, no i have not finished my sentence okay so don't raise your hand first okay ah uh, too fast ryan you're too fast Okay, so could someone point me towards the direction of the train station? Oh, Isabella is the fastest. Again, Isabella. Okay, but all three of you have already answered. So I'm going to give the chance to the other four. Hi, Ethan. Hi, could you point us to, to the train station, please? 
Okay, so first you go through the hillside road until you until you arrive to the north road, and then you turn right, and then walk, and then go straight, and went until you saw the church. All right, and okay, then turn right, right again. Okay. Until you see the church, not you saw the church. Okay, right. until you see the church, and then you turn right. All right. And then you walk, and then you go straight, and until you and then turn right and you'll see the train station when do you turn right when you walk straight when do you turn right? um you turn you turn right after you pass the news agent ah after you pass the news agent okay that's fantastic well done okay maybe we can do one more maybe we can do one more okay the next person uh hmm so enthusiastic william you have raised your hand okay not yet i have not yet said my location let's see next person will lead us we was our starting point is different right now our starting point is the bus stop okay we are at the bus stop looking towards the direction of the grand hotel that is our starting point i have not yet said our destination our destination is the sports center who can Tell us how to go to the sports center from the bus stop. All right. Hmm, hmm, hmm. So many of you are raising your hands. Okay, I'm gonna choose by random. Uh, let's see. Okay. Hi, Isabella. Hello. Okay, our starting location is the bus stop. How can we get to the sports center from the bus stop? Like first, go down. And then go down go where right. you have to tell us go, the direction. Go, go down to the station road until you see the train station, and then go straight, straight, and then and then until you go to the road, you see the church. Go go down until you see the King's Head Rock Pub, and you see and you are in the north. Then go to the Charlie Street and then go up. It's, it's a sports center. There's a sports center. Well done. Well done. Okay, you have improved from just now. All right, next one. I'm going to get someone who hasn't spoken much. Uh, let's see. Uh, Stephen. Hi, Stephen. Hi. Hi, we are at the bus stop. Could you please lead us to the Grand Hotel, please? From the, from the bus stop? Yes, from the bus stop. Turn left into Station Road and walk straight ahead until you see the supermarket and turn right. Until you see the supermarket? You'll see the but if you see the supermarket, uh, you're on Park Lane uh, already. Uh, from North Road, you see the supermarket from I North see, Road. I see. And then you turn right uh, into the cafe and walk straight ahead. And then, and then you arrive at the hotel. All right, well done. Okay, last one. Maybe I'm gonna get. Zwen, Zwen, hi. Hello. Hi, you've been quite quiet. Can you hear me? Hi, can you say hi? Yeah. All right. We are trying to get to the. We are trying to get to the cinema from the bus stop. We are at the bus stop right now. We are trying to get to the cinema. Could you lead us there? Yeah. All right, please start. Walk right to the station road. Uh, which and direction are we turning first? Like straight. Straight? To like the station road. And then? And left to the north road. Left to the north road. Walk straight and turn left. Walk straight and turn left into? To, into hillside. Into hillside and then? And then you'll see the cinema. You will see the cinema on your? Left. Left, okay. Thank you very much. Okay, remember to use directions uh, to give give uh, clearer instructions, okay?
Well done. Okay, the last one, maybe. I'm just going to get. Hi, Crystal. Hello. Hi, Crystal. You can hear us, right? Okay, let me let me give you a... Could you please... We are Again, we are at the bus stop. Okay, could you okay. lead us to the bank, please? Mm. All right. Crystal, could you adjust your camera first so that we can see your face? Okay. William as well. Hi, William. Please adjust your camera. Okay, Crystal. Hi. Could you please lower your camera a little bit? Okay. So, could you please lead us to the bank from the bus now? You, you may start now. Yes, sir. Do you need help in this? Okay, we are at the bus stop. We are trying to get to the bank, which is here. Okay, could you please talk to us? Lead us to the bank, please. The bank is here. Can you find the bank? I didn't see it. Okay, oh. it's at the bottom left of the map. The bank is here. Can you see the bank? Yes. All right, so we are trying to get to the bank from the bus stop. Where do we go? Go to the um, this road. Station road? Mm. Okay, so walk straight along the station road. And what do you do? And uh, go to... Which direction are we turning? Turn? Left. Turn left. Well done. Okay, turn left into? Into the road. North road. And then what do you do? Uh, and then go straight. Go straight until you? Go to the... Mm. All right, what do you call this? Uh, what do you call this? Okay, this is a junction. Okay, until you reach a junction between North Road and Chow Street. What no, will you see? And Where is the bank located at? I don't know how to say it. All right. So how you say it is the bank is at the corner of Charles Street and North Road. The bank is at the corner of Charles Street and North Road. Could you please say that for me, please? Uh, the bank is in the Charles Street and the North Road. It's at the corner of Charles Street and North Road. It's at the corner of Charles Street and North Road. North Road. Okay, well done. Well done, Krista. All right, class. Okay, I think we have reached uh, the end of the lesson. Very simply, today we have learned a few things. Okay, let us just go back very quickly. We have learned a few things other than all the games that we have played so far. Today we have learned to use verbs. Okay, we have learned to use verbs and we have learned to use prepositions. To do what? To give directions to give directions, okay? And then we have also practiced our listening and speaking in giving directions, okay? So um, let me just, how is everybody doing so far? Okay? Good day! Great, all right. So for completing the lesson, all of you are very good students. We're gonna give all of you a smoothie. Well done. Yeah. All right. So, hopefully I will see you again, uh, and this will be the end of the lesson for today. Isabella, yes. Hi, Isabella, you have a question to ask? 
Sorry, could you please camera. say that again? Like, can we close our camera? Uh, yeah, that is just because it's network connection. During the lesson, you must have your camera on. But right now, if the no, lesson... Like, can you... No, like, is there a button to close it? Uh, no, I think, no. You, during the lesson, you are supposed to have your camera on. So why is Ryan keep going off and on? Yeah, I think there's something wrong with the with the webcam. Okay, so I asked Ryan for that. Hmm. All right. So, yes, William, you have a question. Um, I think it's the connection net, the network's problem because sometimes I also um also, um sometimes um uh, my camera also turns off. I see. Okay, so. You might want to check the connection. I think I will also check my connection so that I make sure that everyone is fine. Okay. All right. Yes, uh, I see Ryan is also, Ryan also has a question. Yes, Ryan. I didn't raise my hand. You didn't raise your hand. Did you? I'm just, I didn't raise my hand, did uh, I? I thought you did. I thought you did. I okay. Did. I didn't. All right. In that case, uh, that will be it, and I'll see you guys hopefully next time. Bye. You may close. Bye. 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 I just bye. Then bye, every people of the world. Bye, people. Bye, Ryan.